I'm making it, Gary. Just, just hanging in there, man. I'm ready today. Who do you got to pull in? John Ruggiero, Marcio Barbosa. Both are excellent pullers. I'm looking forward to it. It's going to be some good action. Who's your biggest competition, brother? Biggest competition? I would say John Ruggiero probably left hand. Marcio definitely right. So it's going to be it's going to be hell. And then, I, you know, I, I can't forget been about... training hard? I've been training hard. Just strictly on speed. I don't need to get any stronger. I'm just slow. So that's all I need to work on, speed. Talk to me about these super matches you watch. Oh, it's excited matches. I mean, uh, the Canadian champ, um, it, it was awesome. And, 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 and the comeback, I mean, for the guys to... Yeah, Vince Gerard coming back. I know, winning like that. 2-0. That is... And the, the Canadian champ didn't know how to defend against that press. Most people don't. They run from it. What do you do? How do you defend? You, you put pressure in there. You, you match it just enough so when they when they press inside, when they come towards you, you got enough pressure where they slip around your power. If you low back, you just press you straight down. So you, it, you have to you have to be able to control that. I mean, you, you have to match that power in there because they're loading on your arm. So just push back in there just enough to match it, like 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 back pressure. If you got back pressure, if somebody is a, is giving you back pressure, just apply just enough to maintain it. So if they uh, applying down pressure like that with the tricep, then just give enough pushback so that you maintain that. So now the match starts equally again. Howard Owen says he's coming after you. Well, we'll see. I think I have a little thing I'm going to win. <laughs> he says he's been training. Marcio Barbosa he says, watch out. OK. <laughs> Does that scare you at all? No, not really. It's good. It's fun. It's good for the sport, you know. You have somebody you want to beat. He got me uh, in the Risen Sun the first match. I underestimated him, and I thought, wow, this guy <laughs> got something. And then I, I got him next, and now I know who I, who's who's he who's he who's who he <laughs> who he is. Sorry. Now, Travis Bajan says that you got one of the fastest hits in the sport. What do you think about him saying that about? You? He's right. It's because he is smart. Yeah, <laughs> What do you think about Tom Nelson getting taken by Mike Cool? Because of the freaking rules. I don't know. Hey, I don't know. Right. I, ne I never meet. I never meet uh, Mike Cool lefty. I just meet him righty. So I don't know. Is that strong? Do I smell Marcio Barbosa, Mike Gould match, left handed super match sometime well, in the future? I don't I'm know. Ready. I'm ready. <laughs> you want something? I'm ready to do today, it. My friend. Thank you. I appreciate it. <laughs> my name is Chris Ratchford. Where are you from? I'm from Peckville, Pennsylvania. And uh, what are you doing here today? I'm arm wrestling. You're arm wrestling. What weight class are you pulling? I pull super heavies left. Who do you got to pull today? I have to pull Reggie Ward. Um, let's see. Probably Tom Nelson, Todd Opitz. I don't really know who's in the class, to be honest with you. Have you pulled any of these guys before? I've pulled Todd Opitz before. I've pulled Reggie Ward before. How do you do against those guys? I usually lose to Reggie, and against Mr. Opitz, sometimes I win, sometimes I lose. Tell me, what do you think about those super matches you just had? I think they were awesome. I really enjoyed watching them. They were a true pleasure. Yeah, what do you think about the match coming up tonight? To be honest with you, I think it's going to be 4 0 Travis Badger. I don't think Jerry has a chance. We'll see. Thanks for your time, bro. You're brother. welcome. Thank see you. you. On TV. You got it. Thank you. 198 pounds, jumping up into 243 plus pounds, and uh, nothing to lose, which is exactly the way I like it. Seems there's a lot of exciting things that have been happening. Over it's the last always been months. exciting. The only difference is now we got Arm TV to catch it and replay it for everybody. The excitement was always there. Now it's just available for viewing. Uh, it is freaking awesome traveling around, seeing all this great matches. What do you think of the matches that we saw so far? Well, my predictions, I picked the Braille to win, I picked Benji to win, and I picked Travis to win, 3-0. That's my opinion. What about the, uh, Mike Bull with Tom Nelson? I, I would have thought that it was Nelson, so I'm three for four. Uh, Mike Gould is my first match right-handed. Yes, sir. Mike Gould took care of him pretty easily. What does that mean for Mike Gould next? You see a Mike Gould versus somebody else? Well, he don't got enough for Travis. I would like to see Mike Gould versus Georgie Gillespie. 
He's 189 pounds, and I'll put my thousand dollars down that he whacks my ghoul three zero in a best of five. Really? Not because I don't like my ghoul. My ghoul's outstanding. I just happen to have a guy who's that strong. So we got a thousand bucks for a 190 pound guy, unknown. No one's ever heard his name against Mike Gould, left-handed, best of five. Whenever they're ready. Yes, sir. Set you off when you keep. Uh, it happened the same way. He's as weak as uh, they get. Sorry, I'm very upset at that man. I try. I'm trying my best to stay calm, but he's got me ready to go. So he didn't give you anything. No, he's about as good as. Let's see. They got that uh, women's left-handed amateur overall champ. What's her name? She'd give him a good run right-handed. Uh, Paul Walter just beat. Yeah, Paul beat him. So, uh, Alan. Who's up next? Me and Paul. Uh, me, well, for for my match, it's me and Paul, and then Alan and Guy are arm wrestling. Alan's gonna smoke Guy. Uh, Alan's gonna smoke Guy. What happens between you and Paul? I'm really interested. Uh, if he tries to mess with my hand, I'm gonna really beat him easy. But if he's smart and realizes that my hand's not gonna budge, he he better make it an arm match because that's his only chance. Are you gonna win this class? Easily. Easily. Back guy. Back pressure. Back. Ready to go. Oh, 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 oh. Elbow foul. Nightless horse will gain position with his elbow. Tom Nelson and Paul Walker. Oh, 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 oh. A lot of people are going to do it. This way. It's got to come this way. Ready, go! Yeah! yeah. by Walter. Nelson gets positioned in a hook. Wow! And Tom Nelson, look at the inside power on Tom Nelson, your winner from Sacramento, California, Tom Nelson. Wow! Oh, you got him just like this close to the back. What, what can you do next time? I think I have to give him uh, more back pressure, come more out on his hand to top roll. How do you feel? Pretty good. I'm surprised he, was, he brought you back. Were you surprised? No, I wasn't surprised. surprised. No. He's a strong guy. He's good. What, what do you think is the outcome? Uh, who's... I'm going to win it. Towards guy. Ready to go. Big hit by Walter in the pin. Paul Walter is your winner. Paul Walter's going to get a couple of minutes, and then he's going to pull Tom Nelson, the winner of that. Right there. You guys are good right there. Ready to go. Walter ends up inside with Tom again. Tom has got position in a hook, and he wins. Tom Nelson is your 200-pound yeah! 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 yes! champion. That's why I came here. What's cash? Armrest is not about money. I'll spend that thousand, but this memory of this tournament will never go away. That's what I'm here for. That's it. I don't want to arm wrestle for money. I want to arm wrestle everybody. Everybody. Everywhere, anywhere. I don't care. I don't mean to disrespect anybody. Can you listen to our TV radio? Yeah, yeah. Awesome. Awesome. Perfect. Incredible. But they, you do need to do what everybody's asking. You need to start categorizing people when, so they can look up who's who and what matches where. We need you to do it. Because we want my arm TV. Let's hear yeah. it Tom Nelson. Let's hear it Paul Walker. Nelson from Sacramento, California, is your Supermatch champion for the day. Congratulations, Tom Nelson. Beat Milano's got something for you. Let's see it. A pair of sculpted arms and $1,000 for Tom Nelson, your 242-pound champion. Go, ready? And then prompt two I got him, too. Karma. Karma. Seriously, tell you. I do. 
sir. I didn't have the left hand. Hey, you know what, though? Thank you for the awesome experience. Oh, no problem. Got 10 of those. Good job. One for you. Good job, man. Thank you so much. I Very appreciate impressive. It. Paul, Paul Walter predicted he would win that. Did, did he come close? Did he give me anything? Okay, if that guy stops arm wrestling my hand, he'll beat me. But he's going in my hand. That's like arm wrestling Travis Lodi. You don't do it. You don't do it. There's things you don't do. You don't go up to Jerry Catterett and drop Ooh. your wrist and go in with the shoulder, do you? No. No. You break your arm. What do you think about that match coming up, Travis Jerry? What's, what's your take about I really don't know. Tom, Jerry Catterett has impressed me, but Travis is unbelievable. Travis is unbelievable. He'll pull your wrist out of socket and hold it there. No one else can do that. Jerk. <laughs> Guy, let's tell, us, tell us what's going on with you today. Filling in for Rob Bigwood in the 242 Super Match with Paul Walters, Alan Stilke, and Tom Nelson. And uh, I feel great. Uh, I feel like the underdog. I'm the oldest one and, you know, probably less respected at this point coming into this. Uh, but you've got experience on your belt. I'm going to try to use that to my best today. How long have you been on this? Started in 1977. It's like, I can't add. So. <laughs> Well, I mean, they did the vote on, online, and Paul Walters won the vote. Tom Nelson came in second. Uh, so, I mean, but we, still have, we still have the arm wrestle. So. You saw Tom Nelson arm wrestle, so he's a little tired. That's left-handed, though. Shouldn't take anything away from his right hand. To be, not only to lose your hand, but to be open like this and hold people like that, you're a freak, John. Yeah, but... The difference between, Gary, you want to get this? The difference between me taking third at the Nationals and trapping out today was training. Um, I trained every day at, for the Nationals. I trained till I was nauseous. You should have left. He's going, I'm coming. Sooner or later, I'm going to get there. I'm coming. I'm coming. Left hand. I'm going to give it a shot. Go! No, stop, stop, stop. Elbow up. Bandage game. Pull it over. One foul. Hold that. Uh oh, over here. Ready, go! Okay, you know that. Heather Pamela takes the end control. Heather Lisa's fighting, but Heather Pamela is the winner. Heather Pamela wins both weight classes. Oh, come on. Congratulations, the national champ with a fascinating win. Winner is Sue Fisher. Winner, Carol Pitt. Your winner. Oh, Dan. Go, Go, Jen. Big hit by Jen the boys, and your winner. Get yourselves ready because we're running the super match next. Ready, go! Here we go. Ready, go. Heather Pembroke, oh, Sue Fisher, battling the side of the table. Heather Pembroke continues to amaze. I might go to this. Sue Fisher, yeah. national champion yeah. from Fairless Hills, Pennsylvania. Right there, ready, go. Sue Fisher off the go. Position. Your winner is Cindy Looney from Milton, Connecticut.